Bags can weave, hammers on rise away the Monday waving their arms mm. I'll take that risk, I'll take that chance Ocean views, back at this ball, thinking about my life and the waves they pass Stressful times, how many times Welcome back to another vlog. We're here at Six Flags Magic Mountain. We're actually here to check out Scream Break. I don't know how tonight's gonna go because the past couple weeks, it's been dead here at Scream Break, but even one of the employees said that tonight, there's a lot of people. I think it's gonna be interesting to actually see it, but I'm a little bit intimidated because normally, you know, we're here during like a chill day. Oh, that was really sweet. I just met Anthony. I'm so sorry, Anthony. I didn't ask you to be in the vlog. Thank you for saying hi. So I guess we're just gonna go check out what Screen Break is all about. That's right, we're pre-partying for Screen Break. No standing, no standing, no ovation. Sick of slack messages and begging for vacation. I know I got mines and made Betty Crocker with the cake. Is this the first scare zone? I think it is. It's kind of exciting, I guess. <laughs> Oh, it looks so pretty! <laughs> Love the vibe! Hi! Wow, this is definitely different from daytime Six Flags. The music is so loud. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get uh, copyrighted. There's a lot of kids who are here. I'm sure they're having fun. They sound like they're having fun. I can't promise that the footage for Batman or probably any of the rides is going to be good because it's most likely going to be grainy since it's nighttime. That's why I'm always here uh, during the daytime. Let's not waste any time because <laughs> the time is ticking. We only have three hours in the park. different. Back row Batman, definitely different at night. Or I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna check out a ride or if we're gonna walk through a maze because there are only two mazes available. So the area for screen break is only from DC Universe all the way down that way. I was thinking it would be the whole park but no it's only certain areas of the park. Is Goliath open? Because we rode that last time. So what do they have? We have Vault 666, which is a pretty good maze. Oh, this is pretty cool. It's soju and fruit punch. Too bad. Nice, no line. Here we go. You can go through Condemned. Oh, it's Condemned House Party. Thank you. Different vibe. Welcome to
are you Definitely different. I was thinking it was gonna be scary, but it was actually just like all party theme. 1029 Scream Break doesn't end until what time at midnight. In my mind, I thought that the whole park would be open, or I know that there are certain rides that are open, but I'm also just trying to be mindful when we go on the rides that it's gonna be so dark that you're not even gonna be able to see anything. So, you know what? I think I'm gonna end the night here. It was a lot of fun. The vibe was definitely really good. Okay, I, I gotta give it to Six Flags for thinking about Scream Break because it was definitely a different twist to Fright Fest. You know, it has more of a party vibe and you can tell everyone's just happy to be here. Like people, energy, so um, I'm gonna say yeah, I had a lot of fun. Even though, you know, I'm here by myself, it was definitely a lot of fun to experience this because I don't know if they had this last year. Hope you enjoyed hanging out and uh, kind of see what Scream Break's all about. If you ever get a chance to check it out, definitely would recommend. There were a lot of kids here tonight, a lot of teenagers, and just a lot of people having fun. We'll be back here, of course, to check out the coasters. Just want to thank you so much for hanging out with me. Hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you have any ride requests, please leave them below because next time we're here, it will definitely be during the daytime. Thank you as always so much for watching. Have an amazing week and I'll see you in the next vlog.